The wicked dragon that has held you prisoner for a hundred years. Be careful, Prince Rudy! Be gone, dragon! Oh. <laughs> oh, Prince Rudy, you are my hero! Poppy, why is Owl being the prince? Because it's his turn! You were the skateboarding pirate captain last time, remember? I'd make a really good prince. Prince Rudy is a hero, and you need to understand about heroes to play a hero well. But I'd be a real hero. Look at me. See? Thanks, Mo. Being a royal tailor is boring. It doesn't get to fight with dragons or ride a horse or do anything. But he's really important for the story. If it wasn't for the royal tailor, Prince Rudy wouldn't have his magic gloves. And without the magic gloves, the prince wouldn't be able to rescue me. Hello, Egbert. Would you like to be in our play? What would I be? You could take the part of the palace cook if you'd like. He's really funny. Will the cook be able to swing his arms in a special way? If he wants to, of course. But then everyone will see the special way I swing my arms. Oh, no, thank you, Poppy Cat. I need to keep it secret. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> OK, everyone, let's take a break and try on the costumes. Oh, I love being a princess. I bet my outfit will be really boring. I wish I could have a cool costume like Owl's. Hmm. Where are all the costumes? Moths! <gasps> They've eaten everything! <sighs> There's not much point doing the play now. I wouldn't need a costume to be the prince. Don't worry, I know a place where we can get new ones. It's called the Famous Costume Cave on Golden Island. Oh, Poppy, can we go and get new costumes? And perhaps we can have an adventure. And I can show you how heroes behave. That's settled then. We're off to the famous costume cave. But first, we're going to need a sailing ship. <laughs> Any sign of land, Mo? Nothing yet, Captain Bobby. This is a wonderful play, Poppy. I'm actually glad the moths ate the old costumes. The show will be even better with new ones. <laughs> Thank you, Al. Everyone's brilliant in their part. It's going to be the best play ever. If I can learn all my lines. <laughs> my hands are so... <laughs> Zuzu, I'm trying to learn my lines for the play. Who needs to learn lines? I could be a hero without any words. Being a hero isn't always about dashing around everywhere, you know. Sometimes... Look out below! <gasps> it's just doing the right thing at the right time. Thanks, Owl. You're a hero. You're just like Prince Rudy. <gasps> I think I see Golden Island, everyone. Get ready to drop anchor and go ashore. I'm not 
entirely sure where the famous costume cave is. But we'll just ask the next person we see. Oh, hello, Egbert. Egbert? Who is this Egbert? I am Butterfly McVelveteen, famous flying fashion designer. Let me get a good look at your clothes. Oh, you all look terrible. Why are you wearing that hat? Me? Oh, because I thought, it's Thursday. I think I'll wear my bubble hat today. Egbert, oh, I mean, Mr McVelveteen, can you help us? We're trying to find the famous costume cave. Costume cave? I cannot tell anyone dressed as you are the way to any costume cave. You must all have new clothes, made by me, famous flying fashion designer. After that, I shall show you the way. Oh, dear. All about the same size. I'm not. Oh, you could grow into them. And you all like the same colour? Uh, I like pink. No, you don't. Stay here and I will go and find some material to make your new clothes. Don't move. I don't think Butterfly McVelveteen will mind if we practice our play while we wait. Good idea, Poppy. So we have to. Oh, yes. I love practicing being a princess. We'll start at the beginning. Ow! Oh. You come on first. My hands are so cold. <laughs> what I need is a pair of really good gloves. Where is the royal tailor? Here I am, your majesty. Oh, no! Zuzu, you're supposed to say, Here I am, your majesty. I know, Poppy, but look! It's Egbert! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. McVelveteen, what are you doing? I'm getting cloth to make you new clothes, of course. By cutting holes in our sails? What holes? There, and there, and there's one shaped like trousers. Egbert, you must mend them at once. Poppy Cat, famous flying fashion designers don't mend sails. Anyway, they were like that before I even touched them. I must go and find other badly dressed people who appreciate my talent for making clothes out of sails. I mean, never mind. Farewell, costume seekers! How are we going to get home? <clears throat> That's a good question. Without sails, a ship isn't worth much. I'd say you're going to have to swim home. Oh, Poppy, what can we do? I don't want to live on an island without my skateboard. I can't swim that far. OK, everyone, calm down. We'll do what Prince Rudy says at the end of the play. We came here to do a job, and that's what we're going to do. You're right, Al. We're going to get our new costumes and worry about the ship afterwards. New costumes? That's why we've come here. Why didn't you say earlier? It just so happens you're speaking to the very man, Toad. I'm a tailor by trade. I don't know if you've ever heard of it, but, in fact, I'm in charge of the famous costume cave. That's exactly where we want to go. Step right over here. Uh, will there be any princess costumes? You see, it's all for a play, our friend Poppy Boat, and we were going to perform it in the garden, but the moths got in and ate everything in our dressing up box. And now we have nothing to wear, and it's awful. A play, you say? Oh, don't suppose you would want to perform it here? My boss, Cecil the Toad Prince, he loves a good play. You could do it for him and the Toad Princess. We would love to perform for him. Especially if you have a princess costume. Let's take a look. Wow! Amazing! Oh, they're beautiful. Look at the cut. Oh, ah. oh well, you look just like a princess. I know. Zuzu, why don't you take the role of the prince? I don't mind. I couldn't. You do it so well, Al. I thought you wanted to be a hero. I do, but I think tailors can be heroes too. 
You're right, Zuzu. There are all kinds of heroes. Places, everyone. Poppy's play was a big success, and the Toad Princess said that Alma played a princess very well. When the show was over, Cecil the Toad Prince asked the Tailor Toad to make a new set of sails for their ship, and Zuzu learned that there are all kinds of heroes. The end. You're my hero, Poppycat. Cat.